Amazing stories with Hiba and Suraj for learning. Assalamu alaikum friends. Here I am with the Frog Prince, written by Pippa Goodhart and illustrated by Yannick Robert. Long ago and far away, there lived a princess. On her birthday, the queen said, "I promise to give you any toy you want. I want a ball made of gold," said the princess. "There are no balls made of gold," said the queen. "But a promise is a promise," said the princess. So the queen. had a ball of gold made for the princess one day the princess was playing with her ball but the ball fell into the pond i have lost my ball made of gold said the princess she began to cry a small frog hopped over to the princess I can get your ball back," the frog said. "Frogs can't talk," said the princess. "Well, I can," said frog. "I will get your ball back," said frog, "but only if you make me a promise." "I will promise anything you like," said the princess. "You can even have my crown a frog has no need for a crown said frog what do you want then said the princess i want you to promise to be my friend said frog easy said the princess i will do that so frog jumped into the pond he got the ball back just as he had promised now we will be friends he said splash the princess grabbed the ball she did not say thank you to frog he said frog what about your promise but the princess just ran away later as the princess ate her supper she heard a sound tap tap what's that said the queen nothing said the princess open the door said the queen no please don't said the princess tip tap the queen opened the door oh no said the princess frog came into the room good evening he said what do you want frog said the queen i want the princess to be my friend just as she promised said frog i can't be friends with a cold wet frog said the princess a promise is a promise said the queen so frog sat at the table and ate spur from a plate made of gold slurp burp now will you go back to the pond said the princess a real friend would let me stay said frog a promise is a promise so the princess took frog up to her bedroom you can sleep in this nice box said the princess a real friend would let me sleep on her pillow said frog so the princess 
put frog on her pillow. As he sat on the pillow, magic happened. Frog grew and grew. Boing! He changed into a boy. Who are you? said the princess. I am a prince, said the boy. A witch turned me into a frog. The only thing that could turn me back into a prince was somebody being a good friend to me. But I was a bad friend, said the princess. I didn't like you at first. You were a good friend, said the prince. You gave me food. You even let me sit on your pillow. The princess and the prince became real friends. They liked to play with a ball made of gold, but they never went near the pond. When they grew up, the prince and princess got married. They promised to love each other forever. And they did love each other forever and ever. After all, a promise is a promise. Talk about the story. Ask your child the following questions. Encourage them to talk about their answers. Which promise in the story do you think was the biggest and most important. Can you think of words to describe the princess at the beginning of the story? What do you think Frog was thinking on page 16? What is the princess like at the end of the story? What do you think the princess learned from Frog? Think about any promises you have ever made. Did you manage to keep them? Hope you like our videos. Please subscribe and like our YouTube channel. Bye!